Pull, Ruthie. I am pulling. Well, pull like we're trying to get Mark Ruffalo into the house instead of a very spiky hulk of a Christmas tree. Oh! Anna Heath let go of the branches of the fir as its needles poked through the wool of her gloves like sharp pins. The tree was far too big to easily get through the front door of their terraced house in Richmond, and it was going to be far too wide not to obstruct the TV and the fireplace if they ever managed to get it over the doorstep and into the living room. But the second Ruthie had set eyes on this one, towering amid the selection being sold outside their favourite coffee shop in the early December air, Anna had known what was coming next. This is the one, Mum. This is Malcolm. Ruthie had been in this world for 13 years, and still, Anna hadn't been able to teach her that sometimes you had to compromise. The problem was, Ruthie fell in love a hundred times a day, and if it was achievable and wasn't going to bankrupt them, Anna never had the heart to say no.